Evening now, we begin tonight in Fairfield County and an ongoing leak at the VC Summer Nuclear Facility. Right now, only one reactor is operating at the plant exactly one week after the leak was discovered. News 19's Alicia Niaves joins us in studio now with details about what's going on. Alicia? The leak happened overnight Wednesday into Thursday last week. A spokesman for Dominion Energy tells us the leak is small and poses no threat to the public or the environment. In the late hours of November 6th, operators at VC Summer found a leak in one of the valves connected to the reactor coolant system. So the big question was, what exactly is leaking? Officials say the leak was water coming out at about a tenth of a gallon per minute. Members of the public uh, were never in any, any danger from this leak. Uh, as a matter of fact, this leak was so small, uh, it didn't actually require that the plant be shut down. But as a, as a proactive measure, uh, operators made the decision to, to shut down the reactor so that they could fix it uh, before it developed into something uh, larger. Holt says all of the water was captured inside this big round structure known as the containment building. It's designed to catch any liquids and prevent them from going into the environment. The containment building contains uh, any materials in it, uh, whether they be liquids or, or, or gases, until uh, it can be evaluated and tested. Um, and uh, if it's safe, it, it will be released. The plant remains shut down. So News 19 also asked, when will the plant reopen? We were told that answer could not be released because it is, quote, market sensitive information. In the meantime, crews are still in the process of making repairs. They're taking advantage of the time that the reactors are shut off to do other maintenance on the facility. We'll, of course, keep you posted as soon as we learn more. Alicia Niaves, News 19, WLTX.